What is going on, guys? Welcome back. Commentary for you. First home game of the year for the Indianapolis Gladiators hosting the Montreal Terrapins. We're going to wear our silver pants. We're going to make them wear their yellow pants. They actually brought the snow with them from Canada. I will let you watch this back and forth field position battle and be back to discuss it with you in the week with more commentary. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Indianapolis, Indiana. My name is Dave Stevens, and I'm joined, as usual, by Mike Steele. This game is shaping up to be really exciting, Dave. Both teams are primed and ready for some football. Oh, you hit the nail on the head with that, Mike. Let's see how things develop today. Harrison sends it off. Carr takes the kickoff. Makes the return up to the 23. Let's take it down to Emma Adams on the sidelines. Emma, what have you heard? Guys, I've been standing by the heater on the sidelines since I got out here, and I can tell you firsthand that it's not helping much. The field has heating elements underneath the surface, but the snow's continuing to build up, if that gives you any indication of the temperature. I'm not sure how these guys are out there playing in this. Thanks for that, Emma. Coming out in the gun. Black, 21. Black, 21. Go. He hands it to number 23. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. When you can pick up the first by running, it really opens up your playbook for the next set of downs. Red 10. Red 10. Dumps this one off near the sideline. Second down. The defense is just looking around at each other. Nobody was willing to risk a finger to tip that pass, I suppose. Green 17. Green 17. Ready. He hands it off. That will bring up third down. Third down. Red 31. Red, 31, ready. Harrison steps back into the pocket. Murphy makes the reception. That'll bring up fourth down. When you throw passes with that much heat, it makes it hard for the receiver to catch, but also for the defender to pick it off. He punts it away. And the kick goes out of bounds. Blue 47. Blue 47. Hike. He hands it to the runner. That brings up second down. Red 10. Red 10. Knight on the carry. A five defensive back set for the defense. That will bring up second down. Red 31. Red 31. Ready. Knight takes the ball. Third down. Blue 33. Blue 33. Ready. Pitching it off to number 23. That'll bring up fourth down. That signals the end of the first quarter. Still waiting on our first score of the game. Lining up to punt. Tonight. Ball on the punt. Taken at the 37. Indianapolis will start from the 48-yard line. There is a flag on the play. Murphy takes the carry. 
Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. The away team accepts the penalty. Some would argue that taking a holding penalty is Red, better than a sack. Red, 44. The away team bringing pressure. The pass is intercepted. There are no mulligans in football, Dave. The quarterback takes a bogey on that one. The away team has a chance to pick up some free points here after that turnover. Went back to pass. Makes the throw deep down the center of the field. Penalty marker on the field. And he can't reel it in. Let's see how the penalty affects things. Romero is clearly upset with himself after that drop. Indianapolis accepts the penalty. The refs have shown they're letting them play today, Dave. But when it's that blatant, it's getting a flag. That gets us to second down. Third play of the drive. Black five. Black five. Tonight. Heaves a pass deep down the middle of the field. Touchdown! What a play, Dave. They committed to the game plan, and it pays off with points on the board. Harrison makes the kick, and it's good. The away team with the first score of the game. Seven, nothing. Instant momentum, Dave, in the form of a touchdown. Out onto the field comes the kicking team. Harrison kicks it away. Carr catches the kickoff. Makes the return up to the 22. This is a pressure drive for the offense. They've got a chance to pull back into the driver's seat with a score on this possession. Red, nine, set. Harrison steps back into the pocket, tosses the ball. Pulled in by number 10. Penalty marker on the field. Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. The away team will accept the penalty. Some would argue that Green, taking a holding three, penalty three, is three, better three, than a sack. Fires one to the sideline. Incomplete pass. Second and long. Red nine. Red nine. Set. He drops back to pass. Muscles a pass. He safely steps out of bounds. Up near the 14. Third down. The defense is just looking around at each other. Nobody was willing to risk a finger to tip that pass, I suppose. Go! He can't make the catch. The reason for a lot of the drop passes is that the receiver is thinking about what moves he's about to do rather than securing the ball first. Bennett on the punt. Taken at the 38. This drive represents a great opportunity to send the defense reeling. Another score to extend their lead would give them the ability to exercise a lot of control in terms of play calling. Witt handing it off. Second down. A two-back set for the away team. Witt hands it off. That brings up third down. Third and short. Red nine. Red nine. Set. Go. Tackled quickly by Goodwin. Fourth down. He punts it away. The punt lands out of bounds at the 29. If the offense can drive down the field and get some points Green here, one. I'd expect to see Green a one. big momentum shift in the game. Harrison hands it off. Second down. The offense with a single back in the backfield. Go. The away team sends men on the blitz. Third down. Third down. Black, 21. Black, 21. Drops back into the pocket. He can't make the catch. Out comes the punt team. Blake. He punts it away. 
fielded at the 17. It's a close one so far today. Let's see if the offense can extend their lead on this drive. Blue 19, blue 19, ready. Quint drops back, makes the reception, first down. You know, Dave, you can only go from first down to first down so many times before it turns into points on the board. Launches a pass deep over the top to the middle of the field. That will bring up first down. Talk about rifling a pass in there, Dave. Next week, I'm bringing him three, duck three, hunting with three, me. Three, I can save seven. money on bullets with this guy. He rockets a pass past the first down marker. Incomplete. Second down. Ready. He can't bring it in. Third down. Blue 26. Blue 26. Set. Go. Fourth down. That's the right call in that situation. The defense is stacked against the pass and is hoping the offense wants to take a deep shot to try and pick up the first down. The away team is set to try for a field goal. Harrison makes the kick, and he's good from 28 yards out. The away team adds to their score, 10-0. The home team would do well to really focus here. They need to execute a quick drive and score to get back into this game. Tackled after a return of 21. The offense needs to get to work here. They've got an uphill road ahead of them to retake the lead and would do well to get things rolling now. Harrison steps back into the pocket. The pass connects with number 15. He steps out of bounds. Good enough for a first down. Quick first downs like that keep the defense guessing. Green 46. Green 46. He throws one, and he's taken down, and that's enough for a first down. Back-to-back -back first downs really has an impact on the crowd, too. Black 39. Black 39. <laughs> Snagged out of the air by number 23. That will bring up second down. It's important for quarterbacks to have a nice repertoire of passes. That was a great example of a bullet pass. We can see some jawing going on between those two on the last play, Dave. The wideout definitely looking to get the best of that matchup. Go! It's up. And he makes it from 49 yards out. Indianapolis. That signals the end of the second quarter. The away team with the lead so far. 10, 3. The kick's away. Christensen takes the kick. And he's brought down after a return of 21. Emma Adams has a report for us down on the sideline. Emma, what's your news? Gentlemen, I had a chance to speak to the coach for the Gladiators. Keep shutting them down, is what he told me. They had a lot of success stopping the pass in the first half and plan to keep the momentum rolling in the third quarter. Back to you. Emma, thank you. Black 41. Black 41. That brings up a crucial third down. Green 1. Green 1. He hands it off. Breaking free. Fourth down. I think that's a good call by the coach. 
there's still a lot of game left, and you don't want to force things and make a mistake here. He punts it away. Fielded at the 20-yard line. Well, let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. Murphy takes the handoff. Second down. Green 17. Green 17. Ready. Hike. Pressure coming from the defense. Makes the catch. He's brought down up at the 45. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. We see the ref checking the ball after that. Officially, he's looking at air pressure, but personally, I think he's looking for burn marks. Harrison drops back. He breaks free. Intercepted by number 28. Sometimes you just have to know when a pass isn't there and throw it away. Defenses are not forgiving. The away team has a one possession lead going into the drive. Let's see what they can do with it. The handoff is taken by number 23. Second down. He shakes off the tackler. From under center. Black 11. Black 11. Ready. Hut. Throws. Knight makes the reception. That will bring up first down. Let me tell you, Dave, hearing those chains move is one of the best sounds to the offense. Went handing it off. Second down. Fifth play of the drive. Green, 46. Green, the third 46. quarter comes to a close. The away team leading. 10, 3, second down. Red 10, red 10. <laughs> Tosses a pass down the middle of the field. He can't bring it in. Third down. Red 9, red 9, set. The defensive backs adjust their coverage back. Missed tackle. That'll bring up fourth down. I think that's a good call by the coach. There's still a lot of game left, and you don't want to force things and make a mistake here. Taken at the 15. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. First down. Green one. Green one. Hike. Handing it off to number 23. Red 10. Red 10. Sit up. The QB makes the toss. That brings up third down. The quarterback seems to be changing the play at the line. Quarterback to pass. An X with number five. That'll be enough for the first down. First down. Ready. Harrison drops back. He hurls one deep down the sideline. And it's off. Coming out in a four-receiver set. Red ten. Makes the throw near the line of scrimmage over the sideline. That will bring up third down. A crucial third down for the offense. He tosses the screen along the sideline. That'll bring up fourth down. Playing QB in this league would be a lot easier if all of your throws were that easy. Black eight, black eight, set. set Harrison, up. back to pass. And it's picked off by the defense. 
I bet the quarterback wishes he could have that one back. The Gladiators is unable to convert on fourth down. It will be interesting to see if the offense can do anything on this drive following that turnover. The handoff is taken by number 23, second down. Second down. Red 16, red 16, ready. Indianapolis calls the first timeout. Blue 19, blue 19, ready. Uh -huh. Bullet pass along the sideline. Third down. That's a pro level pass. If you can make that pass, you can be a pro. Simple as that. Black 41, black 41. The defensive backs adjust their coverage back. There's a penalty marker on the field. Uncorks this one out to the sideline. And they can't connect incomplete. We'll see if the penalty affects the outcome. It's been said many times, Dave. But if the pass hits you in the hands, you have to catch it. The away team takes the penalty. The QB did a good job with his snap count there to force that offsides. There's a flag on the field. Indianapolis accepts the penalty. Mental errors are a huge part of the game. This one just creeps up pre-play for us all to see. Indianapolis uses their second timeout. Black 39. Black 39. The QB makes the toss. That gets us to second down. The away team lining up with three receivers. Indianapolis will use their third and final timeout here. Makes the handoff to number 23. It's that time again to select the Mike Steele stud of the game. Mike, who do you have for us today? Ingram for the away team answered the challenge today. He's my stud of the game. You can't watch this game without seeing him dominate all over the field. 